Hello everybody, this is your boy Prodigy coming at you with another Black Ops 3 Easter Egg. In this Easter Egg, I'll be showing you how to get the Annihilator in the zombie map, the Giant. It is another easy, simple Easter Egg to do. All you need to do though is save up some money and get a Pack-a-Punch weapon to get this thing started. Now before you go straight into it, you're going to need to activate all three teleporter pads scattered across the map. Once you have activated all three, the door to the Pack-a-Punch will finally open. Uh, from there, it doesn't matter what weapon you Pack-a-Punch as long as it is a weapon that has some range. So I do not recommend Pack-a-Punching a shotgun. Once you get your Pack-a-Punch weapon, you're going to go ahead and make your way over to this alleyway here. Now as you can see there, you should be able to see a little bag hanging on that pillar. Um, you're going to want to shoot that with a pack-a-punch gun and if you did it correctly you'll be seeing these green little items circle around and then shoot off. Uh, from that point on there are three items you have to find and shoot in order to get the annihilator. However they are in order very easy to get. The first one is you come over here and you work your way over to this little cremator it's, or this little coal uh, holder. As you can see there, I'm lighting it up for you. It is to the right. It is a little monkey. Now once you shot this monkey here, you're going to go ahead and work your way further uh, back towards the C teleporter. Um, as you can see here, I'm heading down the hallway. Uh, as you're coming up the stairs here, you want to take a left. It is the easiest way i found to see this teddy bear here. Uh, it'll be sitting on the on the second balcony up there on the corner. Um, it's something you got to really look closely to find. Uh, once you find it, go ahead and shoot at it. From there, the last one, you go across the bridge and work your way over to the other teleporter pad. This one is a little bit more trickier to find. Uh, you're going to have to jump a little bit to see it. As you can see here, I'm going to go ahead and jump so you can kind of get an idea of where it's at. It is actually located in the bottom there. It's from there, you're going to go ahead now and work your way downstairs to where the furnace is located. Once you find the furnace, uh, look for the open door. There should be one closed, one open. Uh, from there, uh, you'll see the annihilator spinning in circles like so. Uh, you go To pick it up, you're going to have to hold X. Uh, once you pick this annihilator up, it does not take a weapon spot up. It actually acts like the sword in Shadows of Evil with 18 rounds in it. Now that you've gotten the Annihilator, you can now go about playing your zombies how you normally do, just with a little extra backup. Uh, if you like this video, please do give it a thumbs up. Uh, don't be afraid to subscribe. And this is your boy Prodigy, and I'm out. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>